Ladies and gentlemen, welcome to the video. Welcome, welcome, welcome. Today, we're going to be looking at the Brazilian icon, who is a one-man army. Ronaldo R9. Honestly, this guy, Ronaldo Luiz Nazario de Lima, is an insane icon. And I am truly going to miss him because, listen, this might be the, the last time I ever get to use an icon like this guy. On the ball, his dribbling is sensational. And then how fast he is is incredible. The thing is, what I love about R9 is, why I would say he's a one-man army, is again and again and again, I was losing 3-1, 3-0, and the guy would bring it back and win me the game. And he'd score some amazing clutch goals in the 90th minute. And I just, honestly, he just, this card is truly the phenomenal one. He is a phenomenon. R9 Ronaldo, he's finishing his absolute class in one match. Five shots, five goals. And it kind of epitomizes what this guy is. He's the epitome of the word finishing. The man is something else. When you look at FIFA and you think, which card is perfect for FIFA? I know I'm not a big fan of his work rates. I will openly admit that. I will openly admit I'm not the biggest fan of his stamina. However, I'm a huge fan of his acceleration, sprint speed, his finishing is phenomenal. His dribbling is elite. His passing, short pass is really good. In fact, even his long pass is pretty good. And no problem with his finishing, passing, pace, Physically, he's an absolute specimen. He's so strong, it's incredible. Yes, I've just said his aggression and stamina might be on the low side, but this card is truly a one-man army. This Brazilian GOAT is a one-man army. Again and again and again, the guy keeps just surprising me on what he can do. In this stage of FIFA right now, he's 6 million coins. Do I think he's worth it? Absolutely. Just having R9 in your team is a huge blessing. And it's a huge, it's a huge thing because you know many people don't have a tradable or untradable R9. I know that EA give everybody 24 matches with him, but still, this card really is something completely different. And again and again, he just shows up in the right place at the right time. Like, don't get me wrong, the best version of R9 has to be his Trophy Titan Edition. That then medium high work rates is a huge, huge thing. When this guy's in the right place, he's going to get that ball at the back of the net. No problem whatsoever. Look at, the, look at the stats. Look at the stats that he had in this match. Wow. 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 What a card. And I, I know this is my last ever time I'm playing FIFA, but it's, it feels wholesome. Leaving this game knowing that I got to use every single icon. And one of them icons was Ronaldo Luis Nazario de Lima. The man who made me love football. Ronaldo and Zidane made me love football and listen just the way he was a one-man army one man you know one man band whatever you want to call him he was like that in FIFA he's he can score all sorts of goals outside of the box inside of the box finesse headers you know he's just a perfect striker isn't he Ronaldo you know this is what I love about icons they evoke feelings in your heart they evoke passion you know there's nostalgia there you know my dad loves this guy you know he used to call him electricity because once he's gone he's gone ain't no one gonna catch on i know wow what a card honestly i had a blast using him love this man to bits and i just hope you know everyone gets a chance to use this sort of card because he is he is honestly a one-man army i don't know what people say that they don't like him i don't understand it he's just phenomenal thank you